Hello, it's Yita and today I thought I'd show you what I'm bringing in my school bag. I haven't actually gone back to school yet, but the things I bring don't really differ from year to year that much, apart from the fact that this year we do have to bring like more protective measures such as, you know, hand sanitizers and antibacterial wipes. But I hope this can be helpful in reminding you of some things that you need to bring to be more safe, but also things that you might want to bring to be more productive. And I hope you enjoy. So this is my school bag. It is the 13 inch laptop Kanken, which I really, really like, especially because it has padded shoulder straps, which is very helpful. In my laptop compartment, I keep my exercise books. This will obviously differ from day to day depending on what lessons I have. Then for the main slash front compartment of my bag. The first thing I keep in here are my glasses. I am short sighted so I need these so that I can see the teacher and also the board. And the next thing I have in here is my pencil case. So in the front pocket of my pencil case, I keep a mini to-do list. This is just really useful when I need to just quickly jot something important down. Then in this mesh pocket, I have some paper clips and also a binder clip. I also have some post-it notes and a mini weekly planner and a monthly calendar. In the calendar I will fill this up with any key events or deadlines that I have and in the weekly planner I will fill this up throughout the week with any important things that I need to do. I then have a gel pen which is really good for titles and other important bits of writing. Here is my black biro, this is the main pen that I write with. The Papermate one is the best biro that I've found so far. It's so smooth to write with and I just really like it. Then I have my compact scissors from Muji, these are just really practical. I also keep my pencil in here and I always put a rubber cap on top of the pencil just so that it doesn't make the rest of my pencil case dirty. In the main section of the pencil case, I have a capsule, rubber and sharpener. I mean, there really isn't much to say about this. And also a glue stick. And then of course, my Stabilo pastel highlighters. And sometimes I will bring my stapler, but only on days that I think I'll need it. But the really cool thing about this stapler is that at the bottom, there is a storage unit where you can place spare staples which is really cool. Finally at the bottom of my pencil case I have a Casio calculator. This is just the setup of my pencil case when I don't bring my mini stapler. So back to my bag, the other thing I have in here is my water bottle and of course a reading book. I also have a lunch box because I bring my own lunch to school. In the smaller pocket, I first have a packet of tissues and a hand cream. I also like to bring my earphones because sometimes I listen to music or an audiobook on the way to school. And of course, some hand sanitizer. If you don't know me, I always bring hand sanitizer with me wherever I go, regardless of whether we are in a pandemic or not. So this isn't very new for me. I've also got some plasters just in case, you never know when you might need some. And I also have a snack in my bag. If I don't eat a fruit, then I will probably have a naked bar. However, I do keep the kind of essentials in my blazer pocket because I do have to still wear uniform, even though it is my last year of wearing it, which is very exciting. But I keep my main hand sanitizer in here as well as my face mask, which will also go in my pocket when I'm not wearing it. And I also want to bring some antibacterial wipes, which will be used in case there are any unsanitary surfaces that I need to wipe down. So thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a lovely day.